Today is April 25th. It is day one of a 30 day challenge that I cooked up for myself last night. Um, yesterday in the comfort of the couch, trying to just figure out different ways that I can improve my uh, fitness and my diet and my mental toughness and just stick to routines better. On editing YouTube videos um, and putting up two of those per week. One video has to be about my diet, the other video has to be about my fitness and, and how that's going. The second part of the 30 day challenge is going to be about my diet, which I figured out in the middle of filming the last video. 30 day challenge is going to be me eating just meat products. The only dairy I'm gonna consume is butter and ghee. I've been eating more keto vor, uh, so I've been, in, I've been including avocado, olive, and pickles, and onion in that diet. So I'm gonna be restricting all of that and the only onion I will allow will be like a little tiny bit, little tiny bit of onion um, just for flavor, not like liberally putting it on like I have been. That is gonna be difficult for me, you know, but it's 30 days and I would like to see like what happens in that 30 days as far as my body weight loss, see if it would actually affect it as much as I'm hoping that it will. We'll see what happens there. The third leg to the challenge is exercise. So I was exercising and then I haven't been and then I got sick and blah, blah, blah. This is really a recommitment to myself to just be more consistent with being active in general and working out. So the first part is I have to hit bare minimum, definitely can exceed, but I must hit at least 6,000 steps a day. That is the absolute minimum. And the, um, the other part of it is um, working out, actual sweating, physically exerting myself, working out will be a minimum of three times a week. And that will look like, uh, most likely the majority will be hit exercises if it's still, you know, I may also be going outside, getting some, catching some content of that, of like me at the squat rack, I've got a tractor, tractor tire and a sledgehammer. So maybe doing some strongman stuff, looking forward to all of that. Um, it's just that it's been really cold. Like I literally just came back in from a, a 20 minute walk um, this morning and my face is like still frozen and cold and like my snot like froze in my nose, so. We'll see what the weather is doing. But as you can see behind me, I have a bunch of different stuff. That's a rower. I have mats down. I have a, a bench right there. As you can see, I've got some weights and things. I am paying a monthly subscription for some live hit training as well. But she she's uh, it's bodied by XO, uh, Christina. She lives in um, England though. So like the times don't really match up, but it doesn't matter. Same effectiveness. This, this is just really me wanting to see some real change, wanting to get into some real routines. And I just want to be, I want to get my confidence up. I want to prove to myself that I can do it and I can stick to something this strict that I can do multiple things. And then I'm just taking this step for me. I am somebody who I, I've turned into this person of, I do a lot, um, for work and devote so much time to work and don't get up and take care of my body and my mental health and my diet as much as I would want to. I think I have been doing okay, but I could, I've been doing good. I've been doing it, I've been doing good, but I could be doing a lot better. And so that that's what this move is for me. This is for me to take care of myself. I wanna feel better. I'm curious if I restrict even more for my diet, if I'll be noticing like not just weight loss, but um, less inflammation going down. Um, I'm, I'm curious to see what happens there. And then as far as like working out, working out, I mean, yeah, you see physical results from that, of course. Um, the majority of that is diet, but I'm just, I'm excited to, like I'm looking forward to working out three times a week and being active and walking at least 6,000 steps a day because I know that working out releases endorphins and it makes you happy. So I'm just looking forward to being happy, walking every morning, like walking with the sun as the sun rises, you know, and um, just like letting the, the serotonin be created and then working out, letting the endorphins be created, um, all of it, just really looking forward to it. So this is day one, April 25th of 30 day challenge and we will see how it goes. Um, I don't know, I don't know, but I'm looking forward to it.